everyone let us discuss this example in this example we have this series and we have to find its sub let us write a given series we have we have what is the series we have summation n running from 1 to infinity tan inverse of n minus tan inverse of n plus 1 okay we have to find sum of this series what will i do we will consider a sequence of partial sum and we will try to find the limit of that okay so let us consider SN be a sequence of partial sum. Let SN be a sequence of partial sum. Partial sum. Okay. So you are familiar with that. How to find a formula of SN. So therefore SN is equal to we get SN by adding first n terms of a series. So let us add first n terms. Let us find the first term by putting n is equal to 1. If I put 1 here, we will have tan inverse 1 minus tan inverse 2, 1 plus 1, 2, right? Plus, let us put n is equal to 2, we will have tan inverse 2, right? Minus tan inverse 2 plus 1, 3. Let us put n is equal to 3 now. If I put 3 here, we will have tan inverse 3, okay? Minus, if I put 3 here, tan inverse 3 plus 1, 4 plus and so on okay so the last n term will be tan inverse n minus tan inverse n plus 1 tell me can we cancel any terms here yes definitely minus tan inverse 2 plus tan inverse 2 minus tan inverse 3 plus tan inverse 3 minus tan inverse 4 will get cancelled with the next term in this way this tan inverse n will get cancelled with minus tan inverse n getting so all terms will get cancelled to each other except first and last term the first term is tan inverse 1 whose value is pi by 4. So let me mention here pi by 4 minus tan inverse of n plus 1. So this is formula of Sn. Okay. So let us apply limit n tends to infinity on both sides. So therefore limit n tends to infinity Sn is equal to limit n tends to infinity what we have pi by 4 minus tan inverse of n plus 1. Okay. So let me write it here. So this is equal to, so you know that pi by 4 is constant. So I should write as it is pi by 4 is constant. We can apply that limit to the next term, which is tan inverse infinity plus 1. That means obviously infinity. So I should write here tan inverse infinity. So what is value of tan inverse infinity? We know that tan pi by 2 is infinity. So that's why tan inverse infinity is pi by 2, right? So pi by 4 minus pi by 2, which is minus pi by 4. So therefore, what we get limit n tends to infinity, Sn is equal to minus pi by 4. That means sequence of partial sum Sn is convergent and converges to minus pi by 4. We know that if sequence of partial sum is convergent, corresponding series is also convergent and converges to the same point. So let me write it here. Therefore, summation n running from 1 to infinity, tan inverse n, minus tan inverse n plus 1 is convergent series getting so it's convergent series and converges to the same point so therefore i can write summation n running from 1 to infinity tan inverse n minus tan inverse n plus 1 so its value will be minus pi by 4 okay so this is a required sum of uh, required value of this series okay so make a screenshot of it then we will stop thank you bye bye